what's up everyone good morning happy sunday sunday fun day so today we are at a new location something different we jumped in the truck and drove over to uh the beth page state park bike trail and we are up in the woods here cruising through some trails there's a lot of some paved trails there's some unpaved trails and uh it's a pretty morning a little chilly it feels like I'm upstate here. It feels like I'm upstate cruising in the woods. So a little different scenery. I like to switch it up a little bit. Get some variation in the world, in my life. Some new stimulation from some seeing some new shiny objects. And it's pretty up here. Peaceful. So today we're going to talk to you about uh, the concept of not my circus. Uh, not my monkey, not my circus. So in that... As people surround you with drama, do you get sucked into it? Or do you take a step back and tell them, not my monkey, not my circus? Um, it's real easy to get caught up in drama. It's real easy to get caught up in other people's issues. Um, it's real easy to get triggered and to automatically react. Um, but when people are sideways and in their state of drama... We need to steer clear of that. We need to take a step back. We need to not engage. And uh, not engage in the circus of... Uh, well, hold on. So we need to realize that um, it's not our issue. It's not our drama. We need to take a step back and, and break away from that drama, that circus that someone else is causing. Um, very often, we, uh, we don't think. We just react. Someone comes at us with something crazy, something nuts is going on, and we automatically just jump right in, head first, and react, and get crazy. And we need to learn that when uh, there's a drama situation going on, there's some craziness going on, we need to stop, and we need to get away from it, and we need to not react, we need to keep our cool, and we need to um, just basically stay in peace, keep our joy. Don't let someone else's circus involve you. Um, I see so many people getting involved in stuff that they shouldn't get involved in. Uh, we see it on social media all the time. People getting crazy social media uh, keyboard warriors uh, getting involved in some political action or something nonsense about something happening in their town on a local town page. And people get all excited and they're calling out their neighbors and they're getting all crazy with some drama that has nothing to do with them. They got to voice their opinion on something that has nothing to do with them. And they're losing their joy, they're losing their focus, and they jumped into someone else's circus. So we need to remember, not my monkey, not my circus, and steer clear of drama in our lives. Steer clear of things that don't serve our purpose. Steer clear of things that don't um, affect our lives directly. Um, and just learn not to engage. Someone comes at you with something crazy, learn not to engage. Um, it's so easy to get caught up in drama. Um, we don't even think about it, we just react. And uh, once you uh, start being aware of it, once you start keeping this idea in your head, when stuff comes at you, um, you'll, you'll realize it happening and you'll take a step back and uh, realize, hey, wait a minute, this doesn't serve my greater good. This doesn't serve my purpose. Um, why am I getting involved in this? Take a step back, walk away. Um, you know, not my, not my monkey, not my circus. Really easy. Keep that thought in your head. Does this serve my greater good? Does getting involved in this situation serve my greater good? Does putting my energy into this situation serve my greater good? Because most of the times it's not going to serve your greater good. And you're going to lose some energy. You're going to lose some time. You're going to lose some joy over something that means completely, completely nothing to your overall good in your life. So just be aware of that. Um, just about everything I talk about is just the idea of being self-conscious, just being aware of what's going on in your life and not reacting. To think before we react. We're so trained to react. We're so triggered by certain things that uh, we really need to just really take a deep breath and realize our situation and think about our situation and respond accordingly, not to just knee-jerk reaction, not to just be triggered and, and just, you know, react. Uh, we need to think about everything before we react. Slow down a little bit. Take a deep breath before you respond. Keep your cool and think to yourself, is this something that's going to help me or is this something that's going to uh, hurt me? Um, and if it's something that's really not going to affect you, stay away from it. Steer clear of it. Steer clear of someone else's circus. So there's your message of the day. 
up here in the woods, Bethpage State Park on the bike trail. Let's get some prayers in. Real pretty today, a little chilly. Not too bad for uh, December. All right, here we Father, Son, Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Dear God, help us to... Uh, keep our peace. Help us to realize uh, the situations around us that are detracting from our purpose and help us to avoid them. Help us to avoid the drama in our lives and help us to stay in joy and stay in peace and help us to uh, carry the peace around and spread the love around. Uh, spread love. Help us to spread the love every day. And help those around us and make the world a better place rather than causing drama in the world. Amen. All right, everyone. We're going to finish up the ride here, get our 10 miles in. Day 222 of the 365-day journey. Uh, today we got an open house in Malvern, 1230. Uh, first open house, 120 Hanson, four-bedroom, two-bath, all renovated, 76 by 100 property. Uh, that is up at 779, first open house, 1230 today. And uh, what else we got going on today? We're doing our ride. Oh, we got a little Christmas thing at Mom's house and Dad's house later this afternoon. And uh, Christmas week is here, so... That's it. Let's enjoy it. Let's slow down a little bit and let's enjoy uh, the holiday season. And uh, let's not work too hard and, and just really remember the reason for the season. Um, spread the love. So put your head on a pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go. Go start some fire in your life that uh, affects everyone else around you and makes the world a better place. Right, everyone, have a great Sunday. Love you all. Be good. Merry Christmas, brother.